Watch the full video of this river facing modern home on buildify.com. Head to the description of this video to also download the PDF ebook with house plans and material details. This is one of those rare sites where you get uh, such a beautiful uh, setting to work with. This is a house which was designed for Mr. Shah Jahan and his family, consisting of uh, four people, and then he wanted uh, five bedrooms for his house. In addition to the regular requirements of a house, he wanted an outhouse where he could house some cars, uh, driver's facility, servant's facility and uh, storage areas and all. The, the location of the site is called Panay Kulam, which is on the outskirts of Alua. It's on the banks of River Periyar. When you look at this angle, it has a wider reach and there is more expanse of water which is visible. So we thought of making use of that longer expanse of the water because it gives a nicer view to look into. Because this is River Periyar, there is always a chance of flooding. We actually raised the ground around made of small mound and kind of which kind of merges with the landscape so this idea of raising the building was a crucial decision for us because in the floods of 2018 the entire area was flooded and this house was kind of like an island which was saved from the uh, fury of the floods when you enter the house you enter from this corner and then you drive up uh, to the carports. You know, as one drives in, you don't have a water view, and then one drives up to the carports, you suddenly have the view of the water. So that uh, drama of uh, the the view unfolding was uh, was an important element of the design. And then over here, there is the path to the basement where uh, the cars can be parked. We didn't want, uh, want to project a big house from the entry so that uh, as uh, one comes to this side of the house you see only one floor and then the slope roof. So it actually again helps to blend the house uh, with the landscape. All the upper floors are happening behind. As you come to this side, to the more private part of the house, uh, to the waterfront, you actually tend to see the, the, the end, full extent of the house. Because the living room is slightly projected out, it actually insulates the rest of the house and gives the rest of the house more privacy. So you enter the house from the main door uh, into a foyer and then the, the living space over here. And the most important view was given to the drawing room. The dining room is also an important part of the house. It has a nice view. So we put the family room here. That's the family room. That's the family room also has a view. It connects the house between the levels and it's open to the dining on one side, uh, but it's partially segregated from the dining room because we wanted the dining room to have a certain level of privacy. And the kitchen and other areas were placed behind that. So that's the kitchen area. The two bedrooms in the ground floor, that's one bedroom, that's the second bedroom. And this is the master bedroom uh, at the southwest corner and it is also located using principles of Vastu also. It also enjoys the best view of the water. Coming to the first floor of the house, there's the, the, the main bedroom on the first floor is has a nice water view over there. Then the second bedroom also has a nice water view over there. And then there is a 
home theater come entertainment room which actually is stuck into one of the the roof and we also have a nice uh, sit out space on the first floor the garden uh, which actually flows out uh, from this um, common area pool is happening at a slightly lower level so because we wanted to give the pool a certain level of um, uh, segregation from the main uh, space so we lowered the pool a little bit and pool is an infinity pool it has the view of the water the fundamental thing about this project was to respect the, the setting that we were in and to merge it in and blend it in we tried to achieve that and give the client uh, the best views of the the the, the setting the, the the water which is the most important element in this landscape